Good everybody on YouTube, so I just want to let you guys know this is like a two portion uh, vlog slash discussion video. I know a lot of you guys may be tuning in just to see what I am willing to cop from the Richie Lee collection. So if you guys want to skip the vlog, make sure to go ahead and do so. Um, I'd rather have you not do that because I'd rather... You know, have you guys enjoy the content overall as far as the whole video. If you guys do enjoy the vlogs and just me discussing what I plan on copying in the next couple of weeks, and if you guys want more videos like that, make sure to go ahead, drop a like, and drop a comment. And if you guys are new here, my name is Brandon. I go by B Flakes, Brand Flakes, whatever it is. Um, make sure to go ahead and subscribe. I really appreciate it. We're trying to grow the channel, especially with 2022 about to come up. We're about to drop some fire vids. But yeah, like I said, this video is going to be two parts. The first part is going to be me shopping around at the Stussy outlet sale that they do have in Vegas from time to time. It was a fun time. I did end up purchasing some stuff as well. And then at the end of the video, we're going to go ahead and discuss what I do plan on copying from the Richie Lee collection, Salehi, Kai Bentley, um, round two shop, whatever it is. I'm going to be going for a lot this week. So yeah, let's just go ahead, hop into it. What did you just say? Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. Sorry. All right, good morning, everybody. Um, you guys know how we start off the vlogs. It's just tradition around here to start off the vlogs with some coffee. So good morning, cheers. Um, I guess this is just a new thing for us. We're just gonna start off the vlogs with coffee. But today we got some fire Dutch bros. We um, have an extra shot. Yep. Definitely. It's good. Dutch really? Canyon latte with oat milk and an extra shot. And soft top. And soft top. It's kind of annoying to order, but. All right, you guys, so today's little agenda is we are at this place called Fruition. They're having like a little farmer market, Stussy sale. So we're gonna go ahead and check it out. It's my first time at this store, but here's the flyer. Um, hopefully it's a good time, we shall see. And um, yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, so this is the Stussy little sale. Um, they just have boxes and stuff everywhere. So it's gonna be a little bit of uh, you know random pickings, but we'll go ahead and check out everything. Everything. 40 bucks for crewnecks and hoodies. There's a lot, honestly. It's gonna be crazy. Alright, I already found a good box. Got some beanies going. Blue? I like this one. Let me grab it for you. Honestly, yeah. Well, oh, they're only 15 bucks. That's pretty good. Should I try it on? I don't even know what to go through. So the jackets are like 65 to 85 bucks. Honestly, freaking, there's a lot to sort through here, but this one looks pretty cool. It's a size small. I like the print of this flannel. Size medium. But it's honestly gonna just be random sizing when it comes down to put this back. Random stuff for sure. Looking through pants now. Pants are like 20 to 25 bucks. And uh, we kind of filled up this Ikea bag with a random, a whole bunch of random stuff. Let's see what the total is, but overall it's pretty fun. A little crowded, but it should be a good turnout at the end of the day. Aww. All right, y'all, we're waiting in this line now. Pretty big. Uh, we've kind of been here for what, like 30 minutes now? Okay. <laughs> Custom knit stuff. Pretty dope. Looks pretty sick. This one's Mac Miller. I like the colors. Is that even a question, babe? What was your question? If we wanted all you can eat sushi or just normal sushi. Oh, you can eat. <laughs> um, so we just hopped out of the event venue thing. A lot of good stuff. So if you guys don't know about the Stussy sale, they usually carry it in the LA area and then sometimes in Vegas. It's kind of just like stuff that doesn't sell on the site or it's like a discrepancy or something may be wrong with it in some sort of sense, like dirty or stained. Yeah. yeah, or something like that. Usually kind of like samples as well. Overall, if you go through it, look through some good stuff, you know, make sure you're buying the right item. It's worth it. Um, we didn't spend too much, but we'll go ahead and show you guys the pickups later. Sorry, I was like scratching my back the whole time. We'll go ahead and show you guys the pickups um, later on when we get home, but we are gonna go grab some food. Sushi sounds amazing right now. All right. Sushi's here. Looking good. This is the bake. Wait, no, that's 
saw the baked one. What is this? Son of a beef? Jackpot and lemon salmon. You guys. <laughs> back at the crib now, I always start off the clips with Ari, you guys, but back at the crib now, Ari's wearing what she got. Um, you want to talk about it? Um, it's a size small. This is definitely women's. He charged me for a men's. Am I a little bit upset? Yes. Um, it just says juicy, but it's like velvet. What is that? What is it, velvet? Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's like a little bit puffed. Looks good. It's really cute. I, I like, like it. I was planning on wearing it over like or under a flannel. You could wear it like that jacket, too. Something in case it gets cold. Can you show my stuff? Yeah. Thanks, babe. This is my hat. Alright, so this is the hat I got. I ended up getting this snapback. It looked really nice, honestly. Just kind of a random purchase. I think this was only $15. Yeah. Um, I do have to curve the brim a bit, but overall, bad. do like the colors a lot. You know? White with the green. And then this shirt, I'm kind of, I kind of regret it, but kind of don't. You need more white tees, so it's fine. Um, it's just like the print is very, very light. That's the reason why I don't like thing. it. It won't clash with anything. Yeah, I don't know. That one might go in Flake's closet, so if you guys may be interested in it, check Flake's closet on Instagram. If you guys don't know about that Instagram, it's literally my selling page when it comes down to um, just me getting rid of stuff in my closet. And then I also got some Christmas presents. Uh, my cousin doesn't watch these videos, so we're totally fine with showing this, but we did get another Stussy t-shirt um, in the bag, so it looks a little, you know, presentable for when handing it out in a Chris Christmas setting and then we also did get a blue version of the same tea so that's what we picked up Ari's crew neck was the most expensive thing but again like she said earlier they did mischarge her uh, like, <clears throat> but this hat was $15 um, and I believe all the long sleeve t-shirts were like only 25 so yeah there you guys go that is what we got from the sale today while we're here, you guys, I might as well tell you what I had on feet today. So I did have on the SGAs, um, the Converse Pro Leather. Honestly, a really, really fire shoe. But I did have them on. A lot of you guys asked me on Instagram when I posted this photo right here where my socks were from. These are from uh, Amazon. I already bought them off Amazon and just looked up Chunky Sock. And this is what came up. So if you guys want to cop these socks, make sure to go on Amazon. I believe they were like, what, $12 for three, right, babe? Yeah, they're like super cheap. So if you guys want to buy these, and I believe these are like under 150 on StockX. Really, really dope shoe in my opinion. Um, but yeah, that's what I had on feet. You guys, thank you guys. If you guys watched the whole way through, make sure to go ahead and let me know. Go ahead and comment drops on drops. Just so I know you guys watch this. So the first drop I want to go ahead and talk about is going to be the December 10th drop of Strawberry, which is the brand I'm wearing right now. Um, Strawberry jams with my Glock don't. Personally, I feel like Kai is growing as far as getting his brand out there, which is very, very smart on his hand due to the fact that he's not really making YouTube videos like that. But overall, I do mess with this brand. Very, very high quality items. I do have a hoodie from them. Um, if you guys are wondering as far as sizing goes, I'm 5'10 and I did get a size large in his hoodies um, he's dropping five hoodies and a three pack of t-shirts based off of the size chart with the t-shirts i'm probably going to be going in xl just because the sleeves seemed a little short um, but if you guys are interested in the tees it's going to be a three pack of tees i believe they're going to be roughly around 95 dollars or 98 dollars something like that um, it's going to be white washed and cream those are the items I'm going for as far as this drop, just because I really, really need some essential t-shirts. And um, yeah, hopping so. into the next brand. A lot of you guys are probably watching this video just to see what I'm copying from this brand. I know we know it, we all are excited for it, but there is a new Richie Lee collection drop and I'm sure a lot of you guys are wondering what I'm personally gonna go ahead and cop. So the one item, maybe two, maybe three, I'm not too sure. I'll give you guys a list of three items that I maybe will go for, but I really love the orange white flannel um, with the zipper on it. Very, very clean in my opinion and that's the one item I will be going for. Uh, maybe a three pack of t-shirts, I'm not too sure, but I recently did see this photo of Ralph. He posted on Instagram with the black and white flannel and I thought 
thought that flannel looked amazing. But like I said, I already have the past version, so I don't know if I need two um, black and white flannels in the rotation. Overall though, very, very clean drop. I love the pants. Um, you can never go wrong with the cargos from Richie Lee. They hold their value. Um, they fit very nicely. They look good on the body. Overall, Richie Lee collection, always killer. If you guys need a sizing reference as far as my flannel goes that I have in my closet, I am 5'10", 165, and I do wear a size large as far as the Richie Lee collection flannels. And then for the bottoms, I do wear a medium in their cargos. So if you guys need a sizing reference, there it is. Personally, I love everything they have going on. The hoodies are very, very clean as well. Um, you know, daily hoodies, you can never go wrong with a nice daily hoodie. But overall, just really gonna go for the flannels and maybe a three pack of t-shirts. I kind of don't need new pants and whatnot. But yeah, if you guys are wondering, that's what I'm gonna plan on going. So the next two drops I wanna go ahead and speak upon or speak of, uh, round two by round two, which is just their brand. I know they have a store as well. They are dropping some fire stuff. They're dropping the cargo pants. If you guys don't remember, Sean Weatherspoon dropped these cargos a little while back, but they're finally restocking. And personally, I have a pair from Complex Con and I think they fit amazing, they look amazing. They're a little different as far as like the fit and stuff, but I really love how they look and I think that it's gonna be a really, really good drop. They are kind of expensive, but if you guys do have the money for it, I feel like you guys should own a pair of the round two cargos. They're dropping on December 15th and I believe retail is like 160, which is a little high in my opinion, but I feel like the cargos are just so fire. So um, yeah, if you guys are interested in it, go ahead and follow their Instagram. A couple of you guys did ask me about uh, if they're gonna go ahead and drop and whatnot. So December 15th, cargo pants plus more. Um, go ahead and check out. Ending off, I feel like this is gonna be a really fun drop as well. Ending off on a croc note. I'm not a big fan of Crocs. I haven't been one with the whole Croc movement. I love my Birkenstock Bostons and I love my Yeezy Foam Runners that I did have. I ended up selling them, but the whole croc thing. I don't know if I can stand behind it, but these Salehi Burnberry Crocs are very, very fire. I feel like I need a pair in my collection. Unfortunately, the white pair is a friends and family pair, um, so they're only gonna go ahead and drop the green and the brown. Overall, I think these things are very, very clean. And if you guys are interested as far as sizing goes, I did, I did see Salehi post. Um, he wears a size 12, but he goes a size 11. So he set the size down. For me personally, I probably, I wear a nine and a half, 10. So I'll probably go, um, instead of a 10, I'd probably go a nine. So yeah, hopefully it works out. I don't think there's gonna be half sizes. So I'm sure the nine will fit me perfectly. Shout out to Salehi, he has been killing it. I'm very, very excited for these Crocs. And I believe retails like 140. I'm not too sure, but uh, yeah, it's December 14th, I believe is the drop for these Crocs, so yeah. That wraps it up for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys enjoyed the talking portion where I just went ahead and talked about certain items that I do plan on picking up, make sure to go ahead and let me know down below in the comment box. I'm kind of interested in uh, what you guys really want to see. I feel like that was a lot of talking, like too much talking, but if you guys watched the whole way through and actually cared about what I had to say, let me know down below. It does mean a lot. Thank you guys so much for all the support. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, make sure to go ahead and do so. I'm always chatting it up with you guys on there. If you guys have any questions or anything like that, make sure to go ahead and reach out because I feel like I wanna be here as a resource, um, whether it's for sizing, styling tips, I'm always DMing you guys. So yeah, make sure to go ahead and follow me on Instagram. Um, and if you guys watched the whole way through, comment the spider emoji, just so I know you guys watched the whole way through. Um, Spider-Man is dropping. I don't know what I just did, but Spider-Man's dropping very, very soon. Super stoked about that. Uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Drop a like for me. Uh, yeah, you guys have a good day. Sorry, I'm just rambling off now, but hopefully you guys have a good day. I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.